now, Hawaii's most accurate weather with Justin Cruz. Had some high surf rolling through the islands for the north and east shores. We'll take a look at the numbers in a bit. But first, let's talk clouds. There are a lot of clouds to the west of the state, and it's headed to the islands. So tomorrow, these high clouds are going to start to filter through and block some of the blue sky and sunshine. It's going to be cloudy at least tomorrow and through Thursday before it clears up again by the weekend. So just a heads up on that. And also associated with the disturbance is the fact that it's going to bring some heavy rain to the islands Thursday night in through Friday. It's, that is potentially the wettest portions of the next seven days. Thursday night in through Friday clears up perfectly time for the weekend. Until then, just windward showers. Future radar not showing any significant moisture. All of the rain that we're going to get for the next two days will be from windward showers. And that's what we're seeing tonight, especially Kauai. You can see those showers kind of move through. Uh, interior sections of Kauai from the east. Same situation with Oahu, not seeing as much rain, and Maui County as well, uh, as the Big Island where it's been consistently on again, off again showers for Hilo and Puna districts as well. All right, so in surf, four to six for the east shores under high surf advisory tonight. That'll probably drop tomorrow. And there's more north shore surf headed to the islands. We'll probably get some an advisory by the end of the week, three to four footers or three footers for the west and the south shore. So tomorrow bin begins a change in weather pattern for the islands. It's our first day of high clouds, which will spread over the islands from the west starting tomorrow. And now high clouds will be over the state through at least Thursday, maybe even Friday. Still, it's not significant rainmaker. The rainmaker arrives on Friday. Late Thursday into Friday, sporadic heavy rain cannot rule out a thunderstorm uh, near the islands. It's upper level disturbance. That's what's moving through. And then the weekend looks good. If you're going to marathon on Sunday, the winds are going to be light, so you're not going to be running against the wind. Uh, winds probably not going to help or hinder. But at least we don't expect any heavy rain, rain for the Honolulu Marathon. We get our trades back early next week around the Monday time frame. Lauren, over to you.